I don't want to hear y'all saying that you use Bath and Body Works shower gel on your girl. I don't want to hear that. I do not want to hear that. If I hear that, I'm sloppy. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new here. In today's video, I'm going to be doing a little, you know, feminine hygiene must-haves. Okay, my favorite feminine hygiene products, you know, because I just want to put y'all on. You're my girl and I'm your girl and I'm just here to put you on. <laughs> okay, to the products that I love, that I've been loving and that I think that you guys would like to. But first, before we get into this video, don't forget to comment down below, like this video, smash that subscribe button if you like your girl, okay? And yeah, let me know what you guys want to see next. Okay, so we're going to start off like, you know, in the shower, okay? So first things first, go up. I think, in my personal opinion, that everybody needs to be showering at least twice a day, Okay? I, 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 I'm not talking to the people that, that you can shower every other day. I, I ain't talking to you. Okay. So when I shower in the morning, I like to use the Dr. Bronner's uh, Peppermint Soap. This is my fave in the morning. It just wakes me up. Okay. I'm going to have a nice bright day. And this soap just gets me squeaky clean. I love that. This is for the body. Okay. The body. Not your girl. Okay, your girl is not going to like this. She's not going to like this. Okay, I have a separate product for the girl. And this is not it. If you use this on your girl, y'all are not going to be friends anymore. She is not going to be happy. Okay? <laughs> I don't advise it. Okay? Because she is very strong and tangly. Okay? <laughs> so, when I shower at night, I either like to use the Dr. Bonner's um, Almond soap or the lavender if I just want to feel nice and relaxed you know then I'll go for the lavender or if I just want to smell nice and sweet then I'll use the almond um yeah this is like one of my favorite soaps she just smells so sweet I love her she's my girl okay so like I said none of those soaps are for your girl okay I, I don't advise it I don't advise it okay I don't advise you using any of those soaps for your girl okay you know, for the girl, I use the Honey Pot Sensitive Foaming Wash, okay? This is just one of my backups. Yes, one of my backups. I keep, like, three backups, okay? I keep, like, three backups because I love this soap. And the one that's in my shower, I was like, let me just grab this one because it's not open. And I don't know, it just feels weird showing you guys the actual soap that I use. I don't know. I'm weird. But, yeah, I love this product because it is all plant-based. It's this plant-based feminine care paraben and dioxide free okay you don't want those dioxides and parabens messing with your gut okay a hundred percent natural um it gives the ph level cruelty free and sulfate free okay no cruelty and sulfates of any kind around your gut okay yeah so the directions are use daily to refresh okay shake Pump three times and wash with clean hands. So I pump like a lot more than three times because like, I don't know, I'm just extra. That's why I have so many backups because I like to use a lot. <laughs> Cause how can you say pump three times? Everybody's a different size. Like how can three pumps be for everybody? Like, I don't know. So I just do what I think works for my girl and it works. <laughs> okay, <laughs> okay. So like I said, I like to use the Dr. Bronner soap for my body. Um, I heard some people do use like the baby. Some people do use the unscented version for their girl. That's on you. Like I said, I like to use Honey Pot. And it's so important to use a soap that's not going to like throw off anything with your girl. But yeah, so this is what I use for my girl. Okay, I don't want to hear y'all saying that you use Bath and Body Works shower gel on your girl. I don't want to hear that. I do not want to hear that. If I hear that, I'm going to slap you. I'm going to slap you because what you doing? What you doing? Why, why would you do that to her? Why would you do that to her? That is not for your girl. Okay, I don't even use that on my body because, like, I don't know. I just like to be squeaky clean. I don't, I don't, I don't like that on my body. I don't like that, actually. So, yeah. But, yeah. This soap right here, this is what your girl needs, okay? Your girl, she needs this, okay? And argue with your mother, okay? <laughs> That's where I'm leaving. Argue with her because y'all don't want to hear. I, I 
just use water. Ew. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> okay. Um. Wow, I hate that for you, girl. Um, might want to try out Honey Pot. <laughs> okay. Because, mm -mm. I wouldn't advise it. I would not advise it. Okay. I'm going to leave it at that. But yeah, so this is just for, you know, like the obvious areas. Okay. This is not, nothing goes, nothing needs to be going inside your grill. Okay. Um, yeah, I mean, I don't even know how you would get that soap up there but i mean don't try okay that's it all right so now that we're out of the shower i like to use some days you know you might just want to be like you know a little extra okay there's nothing wrong with being a little extra especially when it comes to your hygiene okay extra hygiene is better than a lack thereof okay so panty liners if you want to wear a panty liner then i would advise to use like one of these little sprays this is the summer's eve's baby powder freshening spray on the panty liner okay not on your grill okay um i just that's not uh, i mean yeah even on the directions it says to hold at least eight inches away from your grill so clearly they don't want you to be sticking this up there and spraying it so yeah just spray it on the panty liner and you know go about your business <laughs> okay so now this one here is for the girls that did not listen to me and they are using bath and body works sweet pea on their girl and i know you're irritated okay so honey pot there is the honey pot soothing lavender um cream <laughs> okay so this is, you know, you know, if you do use something that, you know, irritates and just in a grin with your girl, um, you can take a little tiny bit of this. This is all natural too. It says mint, coconut oil, and lavender. Those are the ingredients. And, you know, you just take a little tiny bit and just, you know, follow the directions. Okay. Okay, so this is a new product that I've been using and this is the Gillette Venus Daily Soothing Serum. Um, this is more so for, you know, after, um, like, hair removal process. Okay. Yeah, so I like to use this. This is an exfoliator, and, you know, after hair removal, you want to exfoliate, you know, so you don't get, like, ingrown hair bones or whatever. <laughs> so you don't get, like, ingrowns and any of that, you know, get the dead skin cells off. I like to use this product. Um, yeah, she's just cute. I just like her. She's cute. All right, so this is something that I always keep in all of my bags, like everywhere. I always have the Summer's Ease wipes. This is in the scent Golden Glamour. Okay. <laughs> Golden Glamour. Okay, I like to use these, you know, just, you know, like if you go to the bathroom or you just want to refresh yourself. Pause. Hold up, hold up, hold up. I just want to say this real quick. Okay, these wipes are not a substitution for the soap. Okay, there is no way, shape, or form of getting around that, girl. Just because you use these wipes does not mean you don't have to go in the shower. Okay, no. This is for, you know, you already showered, you're just out and about. Maybe you use the bathroom or you just want to, you know, freshen up or just, you know, be extra. This is what those wipes are for. Not to substitute cleaning your girl. Like, no. Okay. Again, I told you guys I do not like using toilet paper, especially, especially in public. Because you never know what goes on with their toilet paper, okay? They could have roach eggs and mice just running all over the toilet paper. No. <laughs> no. When the lights go off, no. No. I don't know what they do in there. So, no. I like to bring my own wipes everywhere, okay, in all of my bags. That's why I have this little cute compact case, okay? And I keep it in my car. I keep it everywhere, okay? Because you will not catch me without them. But yeah, I like to use wipes even at my own house. Like, even though I know where my toilet paper has been, it's just sometimes toilet paper is just not enough. Like, it doesn't, sometimes it doesn't make you feel the cleanest. 
that you want to feel, okay? It doesn't make you feel your best self. So, and your girl needs to be feeling like her best self. So, yeah, baby wipes, it is. Sometimes toilet paper, I don't think toilet paper is enough. I don't like it. I don't like it. I like wipes. Next, okay? As a human, okay, but especially as a female, okay? Girl, you better smell good all the time. Like, deodorant? is not an option i don't care if it's summer i don't care if it's fall i don't care if it's winter i don't care if you live in alaska okay deodorant is not optional like i don't care i don't care i don't care so the, the deodorant i like to use is the dove advanced care this is the apple and tea, white tea i love this one it smells so good i love her and yeah like i said deodorant is not optional don't play yourself okay <laughs> and if you come around me and not wearing deodorant I'm gonna have an attitude because you just like, you think it's okay to disrespect me like that? Just come around me stinking? Like, please do better. Please. Again, always smelling good. You always wear perfume. I wear perfume to bed. I wear perfume to the gym. I wear perfume no, no matter where I'm going. Like, no. Even if I'm staying in the house, I don't care. I'm wearing perfume. And the perfume I'm wearing today is Killian. I don't need a prince by my side to be a princess. Okay, period. Okay. And yeah, perfume, but please do not get confused. Perfume does not need to go around your girl. Okay, like, no, she don't, they don't need to be around your girl. And please don't even play yourself and try to spray it on your girl. First of all, you're only going to be hurting yourself and your girl. And they all know. <laughs> They're gonna know that you just tried to spray your girl with perfume. Like, okay. <laughs> just don't even play yourself because then it's just gonna look like you dirty and you thought that was gonna work. But yeah, this, you don't want this to be anywhere near your girl. And perfume tastes bitter. So, yeah, <laughs> that part, <laughs> okay? <laughs> so, like I said, don't play yourself. extremely important okay to feminine hygiene okay to hygiene in general what you put into your body okay drink your water okay drink your lemon water to detoxify your body drink your cranberry juice to detoxify your girl okay drink your pineapple juice drink you know things that are going to help your girl like you can't be drinking Hennessy and coke and think your girl is gonna be happy she's gonna be like i need water i need water like girl like she's gonna be dehydrated she's gonna be dehydrated oh my god like you need to drink your water help your girl cleanse and function properly and yeah water is not gonna happen all that is not gonna happen if you're not drinking any water like your body needs water. All of your organs need water. Like, drink it. Okay? Drink your water. Please. So, you know, in case you do use something that just, you know, upsets your girl. Um, yeah. Boric acid supplements. I don't want to say pills. Because then you're going to think you can put it in your mouth. And you cannot. Okay? You uh, follow the directions. And give it to your girl. Okay? So the boric acid supplements, you know, restores and brings your girl back to life. Okay? And just fixes whatever situation is going on up there. Okay? <laughs> now, some supplements that you do take, uh, the amount. Also, super important, like I said, cranberry juice. I, I know some people don't like cranberry juice. I don't understand why. I do not relate. I think cranberry juice is amazing. Like, why don't you like it? It only helps you. <laughs> I don't get it. Um, but if you don't like cranberry juice or just if you do even drink cranberry juice, this is also good to do in addition. This is the Azo Cranberry Urinary Tract Health with probiotics and vitamin C. So, you know, it just, you know, helps your girl and makes her happy. And yeah. <laughs> so this is an honorable mention. This is not really um, a feminine hygiene necessity. But, you know, it does have to do with your girl, so I thought I might as well mention it. This is the Azo Bladder Control Pills. Do not, I don't think, I don't, eh, I don't know. I wouldn't say to take this every day, but, like, if you know that you're about to, like, 
be somewhere where you cannot use the bathroom, like that's not gonna happen, then I would. And you have a small bladder, like me. <laughs> Uh, sometimes I do take these, you know, just to like help me get through the freaking day if I know I'm not going to use the bathroom. Or like if you have like a lash appointment or a hair appointment or a nail appointment and you don't want to be that, you don't want to be that client that keeps getting up every freaking hour and use the bathroom because you've been drinking so much water, okay? Then these bladder control pills will help you out, okay? Like I said, it's not necessary. I don't think it's necessary to take them every day because like... Yeah, I just, I don't know. And like I said, it's, it's just like to help your bladder. It doesn't like, you know, like stop it from working. I don't know. Yeah, I haven't, you know, had any negative side effects from it. So, yeah. It's not like after you stop taking them, you're just going to start going on yourself. So, yeah. It's just to help you out, get you through the day. And yeah, that's it. Okay, guys. So that's it for today's video. I hope you guys like this video. If you did, don't forget to smash that like button. Leave me a little comment down below. And, you know, subscribe if you like your girl. I hope you guys like these products that I mentioned. If you try any of them, let me know. If you use any of them, let me know. If you have any recommendations, let me know. And, yeah, that's it. Bye, guys.